Well, good day. Let's uh, jump right in and talk about the corn market. You know, uh, we had the July finish just a tad higher in the day, but everything else kind of took it on the chin. Uh, we had some decent volume in July finishing higher in the day, but the lead month December off 17 and three quarter cents. And <clears throat> I guess the, the new information or the information that we have today that, you know, managed money is long the market. Uh, Commitment of Traders report came out. Uh, it shows uh, the, the managed money long about 253,000 contracts. That's a lighter by 25, they sold 25,000, um, but they're basically long 14 billion bushels, which is roughly just under 10% of the crop. So, you know, they're still in there for the inflation play. They're taking it on the chin right now, but keep an eye on that. See what the, you know, because if they decide to get out, that could be more pressure that we don't want to see. Um, we do have a trend line. It's kind of forming like a, a little bit of a flag. Um, so that's something that's going to be interesting to see if we break out on either side of that. So those are going to be two pretty good trend lines to watch. I mean, the, the trend still remains a little bit bullish here, uh, but you want to be careful about um, getting too far out over your skis. So again, a flag, a pennant formation, we call that. Let's look to see if we break out from either side of it, the upside or the downside. That'll be interesting to watch as of, as of late as well. And no matter what we say, it's going to all be all about the weather, right? Um, it doesn't matter what your opinion is. You can see some of these technicals and for that matter, some of the fundamentals, but weather is definitely a big fundamental and it's going to be all about the weather. So we're going to have to watch that. And what's peculiar about this year is that this weather is this way this early, I think, really. It, you know, it feels like uh, for some of those hot and dry areas. Now here in Indiana, we did get some storms with that storm that just went through. But, you know, it just feels as though that we're trading July, you know, late July, early August weather rather than, heck, mid-June weather, right? So that's something to keep an eye on. Uh, it, it's going to be um, it's going to be all about the, the, uh, the weather uh, that will trump everything else. But keep your eye on that, because uh, I think that's going to be something that we want to watch uh, along with those trend lines. So lots going on again, easier on the day here, July slightly higher on one hundred and nine thousand contracts, but everything else. Double digit losses across the board with the D's at 17 and three quarter cents lower.